All right, let's talk about Pi. So as Daniel mentioned, Pi is not really meant to replace the historian, right? It's meant to work with it. Uh, so with the 2023 system platform release, you can now replicate data from an Aviva historian to Pi. The Pi replication feature is, you know, actually uh, helpful in enabling infrastructures where the Aviva historian gathers data on the SCADA network in a tier one configuration and shares data securely to the Pi server that sits on the enterprise network in a tier two configuration. So while previously you might have a tier one historian uh, replicating data to a tier two historian on the enterprise network, now you can put Pi on the enterprise network instead and have it work with the historian that's on the SCADA network. So this actually strengthens your data security and fidelity and also allows you to segregate both systems and keep the users that are uh, you know, working off the business network out of your SCADA network. So that way you can have a member of your organization use Pi Vision or the Pi Data Link client tool to visualize the data on their enterprise network. So the replication process that you see that you will see in this video uh, might seem familiar, and that's because it's the same process as replicating from a tier one historian to a tier two historian or from a historian to Aviva Insight. So just like those other replication processes, the replication server for Pi is configured in the system platform management console that you see right here. Once the appropriate data has been chosen and replicated, you will then be able to find that data inside of the client tools like Pi Vision. And one of the neat things about this feature is that you could actually even rename the tags when you set up replication if desired. So it gives you control over how the tags would be named inside of the Pi system and possibly label them differently from how they are in the Aviva historian. And you can see right here when you're adding the tags um, from the data source on the left side, found tags, target tags, you can actually edit the target tags um, to make the uh, tag label differently inside of Pi Vision than it is in the historian. And that's where you would do it right here. So you can see that we're relabeling the tags there in the destination tag name column. 